Alright YouTube, what's up? It's uh, Chris here, I touch iPods, and um, I have a case review for you guys to do today. Um, before I start this video, just excuse me if my voice sounds a little weird, um, I did lose it a little bit over uh, Christmas. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I got a review on the Purporta Leather Style Protective Case for the iPod Touch 2G. Alright? Uh, I was sent this case by Reporter a while ago. Reporter, very nice company, very generous. Um, just a great all around company. Alright, so I was using this case for about a day or two um, before I switched on to another one. And uh, I found some flaws in it. Um, but all around, guys, it is a pretty good case. Um, not my favorite. Can't say that I would uh, use it a lot. But um, let's get on to the review. Alright, so as you can see, it is a black leather case. As you can see there, with white stitching all the way around. Um, on this case itself, there's a, a couple of mishaps with some of the stitching sticking out a little bit. You guys can maybe see some of it in there. Um, and there's a couple of stitching mishaps on the back, which, okay, it's nothing major. Um, the port is usually really good at their stitching. Maybe it's just this case, but I don't know. Um, yeah, very nice leather case right here with a little port of tag. Um, it does use a magnetized clip you can say right here kind of to uh open and close uh your case it's not gonna open by itself you don't need to worry about that i'm actually pulling up really hard As you can see all the force i just have to use to pull that open right there um so you can see it's not gonna come open um once you open your case you have a nice uh tanned back as you can see that color i let me move this light a little bit you see it's a nice uh tanned color uh very very light tan though uh, it says Proporta up here, right there, their name. Usually on their cases, it says that they're in aluminum, but in this case, it does not have a aluminum front. As you guys can see, it does bend, um, so it does not have that much front protection. Um, let's see, yeah, I say um way too much, by the way. Uh, let's see, up here you do have their little Proporta sticker. Stitching all around the inside, though, is very nice. Stitching on the inside is very, very nice. Uh, you have two pockets up here to store credit cards or card of your choice or whatever you even want to put up there uh, and your iPod is going to sit right down in here it's going to be held in by these two little clamps uh, as you guys can see in there there's um, like a little extra section of material in there to keep your iPod nice and thick so here it is a slider type of case you just slide your iPod down in there it gets pretty tight once you get it down I put it down to right before the stitching at the bottom so then when you close it it doesn't push down the power button up here and it doesn't go down too far Alright, so as you can see, it does sit pretty nice in there. But as you guys can see, that one of the flaws I found with this case, can you guys notice it with the shape of this? How, how it's going nice and straight, then goes down, then back over. You guys kind of see that? That it, that because of these clamps, you guys can really see good right there, that it does have a big bulge right in this area. Uh, so that's one of the flaws that I found with this case. It's not um, the most comfortable to hold. It'd be a lot better if it was more flat. But um, it's like that, so your iPod is nice and safe inside, so that's pretty nice. All your buttons are easily accessed, your power on and off, your volume rockers, your home. You can easily access everything. If you want to get this out of the way, that's annoying you. You can just bend this back and uh, latch it shut just like that. You can add your case right here, very nice. Um, let's see what else. Once again, your iPod is very safe. I do have a screen protector on here, so it is uh, fitting with that, which is nice. Uh, it's not going to scratch the back of your iPod. It's very soft the back. Uh, let's see, what was another flaw? I had another flaw with this case. Where is it? Ah, uh, yes. Let me slide this iPod out. As you guys can see, right there, that bulge right there, you guys can hopefully see that, where it sticks up. That's the only real spot where your iPod is making contact with the back of the case. So, if, if your iPod, if something can slide down behind your iPod, um, if it's very little and maybe have, maybe scratch it, but that's a very slim majority. does not offer that much of protection. It is for style mostly. So you can see the front and back do bend. Uh, so it's not really that protective. This isn't one of my favorite cases from Reporta. Um, it is a nice case for style-wise, not protection-wise. So if you guys are looking for a nice style case, um, just to go with something, or I don't know, um, just use for a couple of days, it's a very nice case. It does have that great leather smell um which i haven't been smelling on many leather cases right now but this one does really have it um very nice with the two pockets great little uh throw in right there um that's basically it, guys for the purporta leather style protective case uh one more thing actually it is handmade this case it is handmade so 
so that's another quality about it. And it says pocket protection down on the case. So I'm guessing it's mainly for protection while it's in your pocket. Uh, so great all around case guys. Um, but does have some flaws like I showed you. Uh, so I'm just going to go out there and say it. I do not recommend this case for protection. I do not recommend this case. If you're going to drop it, not the case you want to do. I'm not even going to drop it in this video. I usually drop my iPods from about up here. I'm not even going to do that because I don't want to risk anything. But um, style, style-wise, great all-around case, guys. So go check this case out, guys, over at Purporta.com. The link's over there in the video description. Thanks a lot, Purporta, for this um, case. Very wonderful case for style, just not protection. Um, favorite, comment, rate, subscribe, guys. I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm kind of behind here because of the Christmas um, break. So uh, I do have a lot more case reviews and a lot more products to get out to you guys. But uh, just be patient and hang in, hang, hang in there with me, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.